David Cameron wants to renegotiate the terms of Britain's EU membership before a referendum, although he hasn't specified which powers he wants the UK to win back from Brussels. Euronews tackled Britain's minister for Europe. The Prime Minister said he wants Britain to remain in the EU. However, he spoke about some new settlements within the Union. Doesn't that mean that if he cannot reach those settlements, he will have to advocate a no vote in the referendum? He made it very clear today that his wish and his intention is to be campaigning energetically for a yes vote on the basis of a reformed fresh settlement within the European Union, which he's confident that he can achieve. We want Europe to succeed and we want Britain to continue as a leading player within the European Union. And that's the basis on which we'll be conducting the negotiations. He spoke about Britain's national interest when it comes to the European Union. But imagine if all the 27 member states adopted a similar approach. I think if you look at the Prime Minister's speech, it was framed very much in terms of common challenges facing Europe. Yes, we'll address the UK's concerns as part of that, but it's, it's very much our belief here in London that there is a common challenge here and that it's in the interests of all 27, soon to be 28, member states of the European Union that we get that right, that we have a settlement that reflects the diversity of the European Union today, that keeps Europe competitive and outward-looking, not introverted, and that makes Europe more democratically accountable than it is now.